My heart goes out to you. I'm sorry that you had this tragic thing happen to you, and I'm sending you all my love, okay? Everybody join me, please, in sending their support and love to um, the wonderful Anne Heche. Well, not everybody followed Alec Baldwin's request last Saturday for prayers for Anne Heche after her car accident. Alec got slammed on social media to such an extent that it made headlines at the Daily Beast and at Newsweek. Now, Alec wasn't the only celebrity whose prayers people wanted to control. Rosanna Arquette tweeted on the day of Anne's crash that people should pray for her because of the tragic accident. And Peter Facinelli, Anne's co-star in the 2021 film 13 Minutes, put on his Instagram story the day after Anne's crash that he was praying for her and her beautiful family. And then, the nerve of James Tupper, Anne's ex and father of one of her sons, he put on Instagram thoughts and prayers for this lovely woman, actress and mother tonight, Anne Heche, we love you. Some people thought Anne didn't deserve any sympathy, and all the sympathy should go to Lynn Michelle, the owner of the home that Anne crashed into that set off a blaze that destroyed the entire house. Still recovering and trying to figure out up from down. It's obviously been the most insane and traumatic time. Um, confusing. And also some chose not to look at it as a tragic thing that happened to Anne, but a tragic thing that Anne did to herself. Some people, thankfully, not many, but some people uh, attacking me on the comments here. Yesterday, as Alec reacted to Anne passing away, he addressed the alternative prayer suggestions that people had from his video six days prior. Well, let's worry a little bit less about her and the people she might have killed and the people that she was a threat to. And I, I don't discount that. But then Alec kind of discounts bringing that up. The internet, of course, is filled with people telling you things that don't need to be said. You know, we know that you give people the benefit of the doubt. I'm well aware that Anne could have uh, tragically taken other people with her. Uh, I'm aware of that fact. Now, first off, did I miss something that God started to limit people's daily prayers? Like now, do you have to pay more money or do you have to get, like refer three friends in order to get more prayers? So I'm pretty sure you could have five prayers for Lynn Michelle, the homeowner, and then you could still have one prayer for Anne Heche. Like, I mean, the idea that... The days following the crash that Anne was in a hospital bed clinging to life, you know, suffering from those severe burns, people got upset that others were suggesting that Anne deserved well wishes in order to help her recover and survive. People just thought, good riddance? Like, that's cold. I think we all need to take the approach that Lynn Michelle has about this situation as she posted another video today expressing her condolences to Anne's family after her passing. This entire situation is tragic and th there really are just no words. Uh, I'm, I'm sending love to everybody involved. Sending love to all involved. It's not that hard. There's enough love, there's enough prayers to go around. It's disappointing that some had zero interest in seeing Anne Heche survive the accident. Hope you're happy. Alec helped put into perspective why the passing of his former co-star is such a loss. I love you, Anne. I love you. You were a very special comet shooting across the sky. And I do uh, think about you now. Anyway, I'm, I'm sad today. Um, I'm sad.